The Battle of the Blues is the second oldest school cricket encounter in the world and this year it marked its 144th edition. Royal College were invited to bat first with St. Thomas's College winning the toss at the SSC in Colombo. In their first innings, Royal lost their first four wickets with just 64 runs on the board. Royal skipper Dasis Manchanayake and Ramiro Pereira then put on a match-winning partnership of 228 runs for the fifth wicket. Manchanayake scored 137 runs while Ramiro Pereira scored 128 runs. Akash Fernando took four wickets. Royal eventually declared the innings on 326 for eight. In reply, opening batsman Senadi Bulankulama scored 40 runs for the Thomians. Bulan Viratunga took three wickets. St. Thomas's ended their first innings with just 153 runs all out. Royal captain Manchanayake then proceeded to score his second half century of the game, scoring 57 runs in their second innings. Royal eventually declared their second innings on 168 for the loss of four wickets, giving St. Thomas's a target of 342 runs to win. Thomians lost their first three wickets with just 43 runs in their second innings. Captain Ramesh Mendy scored 12 runs. Their first six wickets fell for 76 runs. Ramesh Mendis was out at 12 runs, while Nathan Caldera was dismissed for 18 runs. Sinesh Hetiarachi and Charu Kapiris added some life to the battered Thomian innings. Their seventh wicket stand was worth 66 runs. Sinesh Hetiarachi scored 46 runs. Sinesh Jayavardhana, Netvin Dharmavardhana and Ramiru Pereira shared two wickets each. St. Thomas's College were eventually dismissed for 161 runs. Royal College Colombo have now secured the prestigious DS Nanayaka Memorial Trophy for the first time since 2016. That's the end. What a fitting end. The skipper. President Ranil Vikramasinghe was also present at the award ceremony. Dasis Manchanayaka, who led Royal to their first Battle of the Blues win in seven years, was adjudged man of the match.